Hello survivors and welcome back to another video. In today's video we're playing the Arcane Weaver. Uh, we're actually going to be doing a little bit of a, uh, a weird one today. Yeah, but I thought it'd be quite fun to do. So a lot of the time I come into these videos like, okay, we've got this idea, we're going to be doing this. And well, because it's still the demo and there's only a limited amount of things to do, uh, what we're going to be doing today is actually grabbing only the left side uh, of the, 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 the tree, I guess. So when we level up, we're only going to be grabbing things from the left side. I am going to allow myself to banish these terrible indomitables and uh, the other armor one. We'll keep everything else. I will get rid of Leviathan as well because otherwise I'm just going to land up getting negative speed. So <laughs> we're going to get rid of all those bad RNG elements. Uh, I have tried this before and I landed up getting like 8 or 9 of the armor or block chance ones in a row. And that's just terrible. That's nine levels of damage gone. That's insane. So we, we're going to stick to the left side. We'll see what uh, sick build we get. If we get anything decent. Or if anything good comes of it. It's going to be very, very heart breaking when the legendary buff lands up on the middle or the side. But uh, it is what it is. Uh, there's only so much we can do about it. So we don't have to worry about, oh, we'll, we'll go for a whole whack of level ups actually. And we'll see what we can do with that. It's more fun to see if there's a whole lot of them. Okay, let's go kill the elite. If he would like to spawn. I will not spawn. What am I talking about? Gosh. I just like completely zoned out there for a second. I have no idea what I just said or why. Alright, so as you can see, firing missile really sucks at killing elites. Uh, it's just how it is. So there's firewall. Again, I said I would get rid of Leviathan. Damage increase, multicast, skeletal mages, and fragility. Well, that was pretty good. I'm quite happy with that. I'm very happy with that. Three more levels, we get damage increase, we get a void, and we get merciless. Wow, okay, just randomizing your hopes and dreams with RNG just makes things so much better. Firewall is strong, Shadow Spark is strong. Summon Mages isn't that great, but it's not bad at all. They're very strong, just they're very meh compared to Archers. But for a build that was just put together, like randomly, uh, you have a three minute boss fight, it's actually pretty decent. I think this actually has a lot of potential, so we're going to burn people. We're going to grab a Festeric Struck, and that will be the last one, guys. We're not going to... This will be the last skill. Uh, the next time we get skills and things like that, we are going to land up changing over. I mean, we're not going to be changing over. Oh my goodness. What is going on with me? So that's it. No taking buffs anymore. There's no taking anything. This is our build. Which is actually pretty good. Festering Strike is very strong as well. So we've got a lot of status effects running around as well, which is really, really good for us. 
and let's see what we can get so area of effect no that's terrible why they do that all right area of effect multicast again ah oh, so painful okay more area of effect i guess and more multicast Now we just wait for more levels, so we can just see how we get all the legendaries on the side of the game that we aren't allowed to use. At least we got pretty decent damage. Well, I think we do. Okay, damage with firewall, fast frequency, crit max health and more burn i mean at least the more burn is pretty good but bummed about losing out on two legendaries though but it is what it is okay Let's see, area for void, crit multi, poison, and uh, XP and magnets. Magnets are actually pretty decent. I don't mind getting it. I think void is probably a very good lifesaver here. It will be very interesting to see what deals the most damage. I think it's probably Skeletal Mages or Firewall. But, I don't know. Probably Firewall. Uh, let's see. Crit. Ooh, Exposed Weakness. That's not bad. Slow Behemoth. Damage. Oh, I actually forgot we even had fiery myself. Maybe I should allow myself next time to get rid of the main skill if I want. But then I don't even remember what the first skill was, so that we got after festering strike. So it might not have been better. All right, here is our Alexi. Time for you to die. We actually have a lot of stacks of everything. You just die for me. Don't die for me, Argentina. Okay, more crit damage. Oh, these are terrible. Area of effect there and more crit damage. Imagine if I had crit chance. Vicious strikes. Just imagine how much more damage I'll be doing. Because right now we have 35% crit chance, which is nothing at all. That's like nearly base chance. We could get a, a multicast for firewall, that would be cool too. Some doom and fragility. At least we haven't received like a, an epic a relentless that we couldn't get. Good. Poison and damage for fiery missile. Okay, we finally got our firewall to land up near where we are. It's been hitting in the top right corner for all this time. I don't know why. But it just hasn't wanted to be closer. 
<clears throat> Going all the blocks might be very good for like camping a corner. But I really don't know how the I don't know how the the, the spawns work 100%. The faster you kill things, the faster things spawn. Like is it an armor timer? At this time, X is supposed to spawn. I don't know. Oh, we've got some fire orbs now. Let's see. We'll stay this side. Let's see if we can get things to spawn a bit faster. I don't think so. It does seem like we're moving quite slowly. It feels like it, but we probably aren't. We're pretty, pr probably pretty average right now. Just like uh, most of the other builds. Not really speed running. Not trying to hit like world record, personal best or anything like that. Not really attempting that. Could be something I do love if that's something you guys are interested in. Just let me know. Multicast, powerful strikes, and oh, that's unfortunate. Some more multicast. Actually, where is Void right now? Oh, there we go. I think not having Bloodlust uh, does actually play a big role here. You would not have thought that Bloodlust does things. But lo and behold, it does. And we just go whack far away. <laughs> there is so much going on around me. Ah! Okay, let's see. Slow them. More crit. Uh, only at two levels. Somehow I thought I had more. Okay. We're nearly there. 400 odd more enemies to kill. Which isn't bad. Probably be like a 12 minute run. thing ever <laughs> just let it go let it go grab the slot because it was I'm probably gonna die. We're nearly there. More crit multi. Okay, final uh, boss, incarnation of arts, but let's grab our upgrade first. Getting some decent upgrades there, but can't use any of them, unfortunately, because, you know, we only allowed to use the left side. Uh, 
And done. Oh, I died right at the end. Oh my gosh. That thing can still kill you. Ah, oh, that would be an interesting video to make. The timer stops, but you die at the end. Alright, so Fiery Missile actually did the most. Did not expect that. Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed the video. Please remember to like, comment and subscribe. And always remember, keep safe survivors. Until next time, cheers.